Hello everyone, welcome back to another Premiere Pro tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to remove gaps, pauses, audio pauses using text-based video editing. Not, We're not going to be going on the timeline and doing it. We're going to use text instead, and it's super easy to do. Let me show you. If I click here and I hit delete, you'll notice that that gap is gone. You see this gap right here? Let's just go ahead and look for the next three dots. You'll see here I clicked on it, delete. This is all there is to it. Let's start from scratch so I can show you how to do this. It just takes a few seconds and it will save you a ton of time. Here we go. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab some footage, drag and drop it on your timeline like I've done there. Now this text, I'm in the text window. Chances are this is not open for you if you're just using the default workspace. So next, go up to window and then make sure there's a check mark beside text. When you do that, you get three options, transcript, captions, and graphics. I want transcripts. Now for me, if I go here into my settings and then I go into transcription, you're going to see here that I've got automatically transcribe clips selected. If you don't have that, you can go ahead and select to choose that uh, if you want your transcription every time. If not, it'll ask you to transcribe the clip. Presto. Now, all you need to do literally to get rid of those audio gaps or where you're not talking and you want to just go, you just find a three little dots or the ellipse or the ellipses, I believe it's called. And then when you're on top of it, just hit delete and it will ripple delete. And let's go really tight in on the timeline here for the next one so you can see what's happening. So here, right here, it says, let's go. And then there is three dots. When I click on it, you'll see here that it selects the correct part of the timeline. And if we zoom in super close, it is perfect. All you need to do now is you can right click on it and select correct text if you want to type something in. But you can do what basically you just hit delete here. It says delete ripple and that's it. So even to go faster, don't even right click on it. Just delete. So let's go through here and then let's find the next three dots. And there's probably some here. My eyesight's starting to fail me here. It's a little early in the morning but there we go three dots i hover over it it's 1.7 seconds when i left click on it it shows me where it is and if i listen to it mm. so that's just me hemming and hawing that's it doesn't make sense to keep that in there just click on it delete oops there we go yes delete and there's another one here click on delete that is literally all there is to it to close the gaps using text-based video editing and text-based ai video editing thanks for watching